Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another live stream. Today is July 7th, 2020. And we're doing uh, our 10 by 10 puzzle. We're gonna play pattern recognition game. Okay. Now we've done a lot of these. Uh, we know how the game's supposed to be played. If you wanna know the rules of this game, I have a page set up on my blog that goes through rules and it's got a list of all the videos we've done and some solutions and there's some algorithms there uh, where you can play the game online uh, for free. Uh, and they're really good actually. There was, there was two of them, one of them was not working right now as far as I've seen. And this is sort of spinning off from the original video that we put out, which was the ASR math, 10 by 10 math puzzle a pattern recognition game that we put out in 2014 or something. Uncharted Ace, how are you doing? Chicho, I hope you're well and can sort the issues with you. Well, it is what it is, brother. And just uh, just so uh, people know that are watching this, we just got a message uh, as, as a creator, got a message from YouTube saying that they're doing something great. <laughs> They're introducing, they're expanding their advertisement program or some stuff like this. I don't want to read the whole thing, but it basically said they're going to uh, turn on, uh, <laughs> Elder God, F YouTube, turn on mid roll ads for all videos. Oh, yeah, the, the main thing that we're saying is they used to only have mid roll ads for any videos that were longer than 10 minutes. And now they're making mid roll ads available for videos that are less than 10 minutes, right? Hey, lucky us, as people that enjoy content, we get to see mid roll ads in videos that uh, are less than 10 minutes. Yikes, right? And then they said, now, now that they're implementing this, they're going to go back and turn on mid-roll ads for all videos for all creators i don't know if it's all creators it's my i got that from me anyway right 10 second video for mid -roll, right turn on and just so people know i don't have any uh video ads at the end of my videos and i've never used mid-roll ads the only ads i allow is the little pop-up thing that i think is just generic pops up it's a little thing you can close and pre-roll ads because that way people can if they can't afford to subscribe uh, join a patreon uh, send donations and you know they don't have the means they don't have the funds to support a creator they can just sit through an ad and then they can just watch the content right and that's very it's not very disruptive uh, for the consumer and it's not it doesn't take away from the the energy that as creators we try to create right so it's just another way for people to support the work by just sitting through a ad and sometimes the ads are good right if a comic book movie is coming out for my comic book videos it'd be comic book advertisements right? which is okay I, a couple of times i found people told me oh great there was a resident evil one time i remember resident e evil ad coming out before a comic book video and i didn't know resident evil was putting on another movie i was like oh right on someone mentioned it to me right but now they're gonna retroactively just place mid-roll ads in all of our videos right for some content creators i guess it's easy for them to go and eliminate turn off all the mid-roll ads for all their videos i got 900 plus videos i'm not going to go back and do it for each one and they said oh you can opt out and i followed the links in the thing i clicked on one link and it didn't tell me how to do it and clicked on another one didn't tell me how to do it clicked on another one didn't tell me that and i'm not going to waste any more time trying to undo youtube's horrendous management decisions right because as you know if you've followed some of my work i've used some of google's youtube's products uh things that they've rolled out and then they eliminate it right one of the main one was the annotations i used to annotate my videos so every time you saw something pop up in a video it took you you could click on that video on the screen and it took you to that video or it took you to that link and i spent hundreds of hours annotating hundreds of my videos right and then all of a sudden they said oh we're taking all those annotations out 
so as a creator someone who spent a lot of time putting those annotations in my videos they all of a sudden made it all go away right and annotations to playlists and stuff like this and once they did that i decided that i'm not going to waste any more time with google or youtube rolling out any additional of their products and if they decide to do mess around in this type of way with their content creators right i'm not going to jump through the hoops uh, and undo the damage that they're doing because at some point they're going to redo the damage and i'm going to waste more time right my time can be better spent okay just letting you everyone know here if you're going to be watching this on youtube uh the mid roll ads that you're going to see in my videos they're not because of me uh they're youtube rolling it out and my guess is because they're trying to someone mentioned they're trying to increase people joining youtube red or youtube pre, uh, premium so they don't see ads and one of the reasons i think they're doing this is because there's been a serious exodus out of youtube right with the purges and people just having enough with their shenanigans just leaving youtube right they're my guess is they're seeing a serious decline in their revenue so they're trying to introduce more advertisements to kick up their revenue guess what their model is not going to work right so i'm just letting everyone know i'm going to decide how i'm going to deal with the situation as time progresses right now uh, initially i was a little well people on discord know i was i was pissed right how could because one thing that it does as someone that creates asmr content you want to keep a consistent theme tone to your videos that you're creating right you don't want to zap people out of a nice state of being for a mid-roll ad that's crazy that's not what i'm about right but youtube is automatically going to put those in there the other thing is if people are watching my videos to learn mathematics right i don't want their concentration to be disturbed when they're learning mathematics that's that's insane as a as, as an educator as a teacher i don't i don't want to in my classroom to be teaching something and then halfway through a major concept where they're trying to click links you know we open the door and bring in a circus clown da, 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 selling them coca-cola or telling them to watch disney and then hop out and then continue with the thought that doesn't work right so just letting people know i'll deal with this however way i end up dealing with this uh, i'm you know there's a few thoughts going through my head of how i'm going to do this uh, we'll see how we end up doing uh, dealing with this okay um aside from that welcome to another live stream if you want to know there's some text coming up some chatter chat coming out uh, so i'm just gonna uh, read some of this catch up with this uh, if you want to know how this game is played this is the video you want to see and right now on youtube there's a playlist called see our 10 by 10 math puzzle it's a 10 by 10 math puzzle playlist that has the instructions and here's a link in chat and i'll provide it in the description of this video when it's loaded on bit shoot and youtube uh, <laughs> where it takes you to the link where you can read the instruction of how to how to play this game okay um i am out of town that is why i haven't been around no worries bro enjoy your enjoy your trekking around slick mick that scarface poster on last night's stream man i just have to go and watch it and it's so amazing thanks for oh my pleasure slick mick uh, you never seen it before scarface is one of the greatest movies ever made it has some of the greatest scenes in in movie history scarface i'm glad you liked and not safe for kids a disclaimer right there must be a mass way of doing it there must there must be other god but man i clicked on the links to take <laughs> to see to opt out of this thing and i couldn't find out where you could opt out right and i'm not going to waste any more time on youtube okay d d redoing the damage that they're doing right hey chicho i'm moving to my first ever apartment tonight any advice for me i have a i have a roommate oh awesome advice set the rules hannah right off the bat kitchen clean bathroom clean whoever you're roommating with remove your clutter from communal spaces the way you have your own room you can do whatever you want in your own room in the living room the person cannot leave clutter around when they do cooking if they do anything they have to unplug the sink do not throw 
dirty dishes into the sink where the next person that wants to come in to do some cooking they have to do dishes someone else's dishes to be able to cook right so kitchen must be cleaned okay uh do your own laundry <laughs> and anger how are you doing started watching your stuff on youtube i'll be i'll be wherever you are brother awesome and anger thank you very much thank you very much um i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna make some moves <laughs> we'll see where it goes uh i'm just thinking i'm gonna process information right now see how it goes wait i have a premium so uh advert protected you are i think so for your information is for the music app chicho okay awesome <laughs> oh my god uh learning balance i've been getting a lot of the which of the following have you heard of ads surveys oh god inks vix the most what is this twitch con amsterdam 2020 the worst part is that the french ads i have been having lately have been about pyramid scam yeah it's just i and to let you guys know i support creators the way i support creators but i run ad blocks i don't see any ads on youtube when i'm watching youtube and i watch a lot of videos on bitshoot now okay uh just letting you know donny what are you doing what's up brother this is how i made money check my website so you can get rich too <laughs> like with youtube <laughs> crazy right and youtube is doing the worst decision i've ever seen any management do regarding any in internet company like i cannot believe the horrendous managerial decisions they are making right now to do this anyway we should get off this topic and play the 10 by 10 puzzle right about to go to sleep gonna hang out for a few minutes awesome danite hey chicho i'm moving to my oh i just saw that oh you got to uh disregard the comment okay yeah. <laughs> am i right vc yeah f you too all right leave it the way you found it is the rule leave it the way you found ah uh, no you can do dishes every now and then you can do some other people's dishes every now and then right maybe they have to run out the door and stuff it's a communal thing so if someone every now and then leaves dishes that they really couldn't get to before they have to run out the door do the dishes for them right that leaves room for you to do the same but keep the kitchen clean thank you my pleasure hannah i want to watch more bit shoot but there was too much racist yeah don't surf uh hannah don't surf the front pages of any platform i don't i find creators and i go to the least centralized platform where they're sharing information to consume their content and that's my fake videos on there so i'll watch your stuff and avoid all the other yeah hannah that's the way i treat it oh nice just got home to stream awesome bitch you to full of nazis it's it's i wouldn't say full it's where they go uh when they get banned by youtube um no you uh, donite sure there's a bad element there right but there's also a lot of people getting banned from youtube censored from youtube that need a place to go and bit shoot is the alternative right so it's going to increase and the sane voices are going to drown out the insane voices just don't surf the front pages right good rule is cooker makes the food for everyone in the apartment those that didn't cook do all the cleanup yeah that's a good rule too lucia i just connected here to feel your vibe awesome lucia Petrus. that is a philo okay Doof. what's up chicho it's riot riot what are you doing with a new name brew weeks had my name changed on here hope we are uh you're our well buddy i am brew brew weeks brew weeks oh my god one of my comments on a covid video on youtube got reported i'm so happy <laughs> oh my god lucio jose patro pro sino filo lucio 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 is that good it's brooks 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 okay couldn't get that name though brooks lucio gang if you want to support this work i'm going to do my little intro patreon is where you want to be at patreon.com backslash chicho c-h-y-c-h-o <laughs> you're laughing under my pronunciation of the name 
<laughs> That's funny. Uh, it's a great way to support this project. Patreon, seriously, it's the best way to support this project. One of the best ways to support this project, of course. Participating, talking, chatting, just sending some love is another way to support this project, which is a phenomenal way to support this project, right? I don't put anything behind paywalls. Everything's Creative Commons. Share, share, like, right? And uh, you can just follow um, and see what we're sharing and if you like what we're sharing and if you have the means supporting support through patreon is a fantastic way to do so we are live streaming on twitch twitch.tv backslash chicho live C -H -Y -C -H -O -L -I -V -E. if you want to participate in these live streams live as they're having it happening twitch is where you want to be at for the 10 by 10 puzzle it's one of the most important ones because we're playing the game together right and you can follow and uh uh, twitch prime and tier one sub and all that jazz through twitch to support this work of course blessings dr p how are you doing any streams coming up for life advice i'd love to hear from the sage on some issues and anger i think we're going to do some i've been thinking about doing relationships and in general i'm going to kick it up to heavier topics to a certain degree life dealings um they may become bit shoot exclusives but yeah let's kick it up okay that's another thing that was been going through my head since we're really going to start decentralizing off youtube and i'm going to spend some time doing some writing as well okay any chance uh, you have a 10 by 10 puzzle that destroys this thing <laughs> no you see no destroying states however certain ideologies that are racist i think they should be annihilated right and there's definitely racist ideologies in many many countries right when there's an apartheid state in in the world that apartheid state needs to be boycotted so i fully support bds okay hannah i hope you understand why okay seriously i hope you understand why brooks man you want to talk about crazy lately i still use facebook to talk to family but that's it and holy crap is it trying to shove as much propaganda as it can down my throat when i log in there yeah uh, brooks dude uh, Facebook uh, whistleblowers have come out saying how they're moderating stuff some of the stuff that you're personally talking to people there's being censored Facebook no Elder God it was an anti mass comment nothing about yeah Elder God yeah. YouTube is the manager man if I was running a company the management team of my company was doing what YouTube the management team was doing I fire their asses all of them anyone that's related to them anyone that commented supported them I just clean house get rid of them bring in real people that aren't uh, looking for short-term bump to get their little bonuses and get the hell out they're destroying the company right insanity insanity horrendous it was a nice ride though seriously 900 we had 900 plus videos on there sweet 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 i do announce these live streams and other things on twitter gas minds vk elo and parker or parlor parlor one of the things we shared today when i got the announcement from youtube was f youtube <laughs> we do this one i don't think we're gonna upload to soundcloud uh the audio because i'm not recording a lapel mic uh but anything that's not involved with visuals and stuff that we're doing a live stream on open discussions we will loading we will be loading the audio to soundcloud as a podcast right so you can follow the work there and we're going to be uploading videos to <laughs> bit and youtube right so you can follow the work there the odds are more and more stuff is going to go on bitshoot and i really mean it this time there's only a handful of videos that were bitshoot exclusive but there's going to be more and more bitshoot exclusives and if you're watching on youtube man my apologies for any mid-roll ads that are going to be in my videos they are not something i'm implementing it's something youtube is rolling out and i can't i can't spend and just use up energy resources when i have so much other stuff to do to undo what you the damage that youtube is creating right just letting you guys know this and if you if you are on youtube right uh and bit of course you're watching this if you want to support this work patreon 
<laughs> Patreon. <laughs> where is it? Patreon is where you want to be at. Forget about YouTube membership. <laughs> if you are doing YouTube membership, please do me a favor. Take that take those funds through YouTube membership that you're supporting me. And there's a handful of people supporting me through YouTube membership. Take those funds from YouTube membership, join Patreon and support me through there. Seriously. It's it's a lot better. We get to keep through Patreon more of the funds and you're not supporting these horrendous managerial decisions uh that they're rolling out right it's crazy aside from that gang welcome to another live stream <laughs> uh, fun fun i'm gonna take these guys down i'm gonna catch up with the chat Boop. and these guys and i'll give you a little rundown on the game um how we end up playing it i've been 20 minutes going on this we need to play this game man what's funny is that i can tell what friends i have that are sucked into the propaganda machine. yeah uh, arguing on post meant to get people arguing on faith yeah I, I have friends like that too associates like that too they talk about issues and i look at them i go geez louise man uh their their brains are mush no offense to them if they're watching this of course love you all but man get off facebook what was the announcement i missed that part go to uh, my patreon page i've posted the full announcement on uh, on our patreon uh post okay so i posted the full email on there okay dragon so you can read it and on our discord as well hey sorry i'm late is there something with youtube that is censoring you no they're automatically going back and adding mid-roll ads in all the videos whoa craziness and they, they and they and they assured us that their algorithm is very good and they're only going to announce them they, they're, they're only going to put the mid-roll ads when there's a break in the discussion now just imagine how that works for asmr videos when we're doing asmr and then we take a little break <laughs> and then you're going to get an advertisement because youtube's algorithm thinks that's a good time to put an ad in there <laughs> that's hilarious <laughs> like, the stupidity of these technocrats is unbelievable they live in such a bubble that they are completely disconnected from reality salute uh, pineapple liqueur with soda on the rocks super delicious I know elder god this is more political than a politics stream so gang if you're here for the 10 by 10 puzzle my apologies i'll put a timestamp in the description of the video saying when the game begins okay yeah but discord doesn't reach random people we post the <laughs> to our public to our the post uh, area that get adopted based on interaction besides that i don't use face nice doesn't add blocks take care of mineral i guess so i don't know I don't see them. Wow, nice, Doctor B. <laughs> YouTube, sorry, gang. I'm gonna change the view, and we're gonna do the ten by ten. I'm gonna do a little intro. Think about where you want to start. Let's play the game, man. Let's play the game. Hi. Let me take off my thing. Cherry liqueur nice i'm having some cherry liqueur myself buddy awesome awesome brooks and i pay for the premiums on most sites it sucks but i don't want to be brainwashed nice nice gang okay gang this game 10 by 10 puzzle what are we in i'm gonna do a little time stamp here 24 minutes 24 minutes that's when we're gonna start the, the game right so how we end up playing this game this is a 10 by 10 puzzle right the name of the game is to go from number one to 100 fill up the board right using two types of movement you can place number one anywhere you want on the board right so let's put a one up here one we begin with one right let's say we put one here we're putting one at c7 right there's two types of movements that we have this pen is sort of running out i'm going to use a different color well another black one let's see how dark this is if this is not dark enough we're going to go a different color for the first time ever right we got two different types of movements vertical and horizontal 
we go three squares away from where we put the number. So one, two, three, we can put a two here, right? Let me put this down. We can put a two here. We can go one, two, three, we can put a two there. We can go one, two, three, we can put a two there. If you go one, two, we're off the board, we can't go off the board. So that's an illegal move. So vertically and horizontally, we can be three squares away from the previous number. Okay. Diagonally, we're two squares away, right? So one, two, we can put a two here. One, two, we can put a two here. One, two, we can put a two there. And one, two, we can put a two there, right? Let's assume we put the two here. We go two here, okay? If we put two here, we begin again. Number three, vertically or horizontally, three squares away. Diagonally, two squares away. Oh, we can't occupy that. That's already been occupied, right? So you can't go off the board. You can't occupy a previous square, okay? Now, the blue line that you see here, one strategy we found, it's easier to break the grid into four quadrants and try to finish off one quadrant before we try to finish off another quadrant. So. I've, this is the strategy we used on the last stream when we played this game. So I kept the blue tape here because I think we want to try to same, use the same strategy. And the best we've done so far is 99, which was the last game that we played. And that could have been 100 if we started one unit away. Okay. Because the square that was empty was actually a movement into number one. So if we had started our number one where we had the empty square, we would have reached 100 that we've never done, okay? Aside from that, I'm gonna go to the chat because we're live streaming this and we're gonna play this live with the chat and the movements are gonna be decided according to what the community wants to do, okay? And there is a description, there will be a description in the video uh, and I'm gonna post it in chat right now for anyone coming in. Uh, taking to taking you to a blog post where there's a write-up there's the videos that are shared there's solutions on there and there's one possibly two one of the apps wasn't working at least one online version of the game that you can play and by the way let me show you this let me show you this before I catch up with the chat yesterday we did a two and a half hour live stream where I showed people the, my poster collection right and when I was going through stuff, check out what I found. <laughs> check out what I found. A whole bunch of sheets of a 10 by 10 grid that I used. I printed this off. I don't know where I got these. I can't remember creating these. I think what I did, I made these and I created a whole bunch of these things to give to my students to play like 15 years ago. 18 20 12 years ago when they used to come to my space if they needed a break from doing homework because i used to have i used to hold open sessions where kids were during in sundays they could just drop by and i create a nice space for them where they could just sit around and do homework right and ask questions and stuff and if they needed a break sometimes i gave them these to do a little bit of math puzzle so i got a whole bunch of stuff i can take to the beach now right or go to the park or wherever i'm chilling to do the 10 by 10 puzzle very happy to have found this very happy to have found this okay aside from that gang where are we going what's the movement where are we going let's see i'm gonna put on my glasses for now i'm gonna increase the text size here on the chat oh that totally threw me off week pa, 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 pa. where should we start gang b2 seems fine a10 someone says so we get a second or we go with the first movement Oop. b2 a10 going once going twice we're going with b2 let's do b2 number one this a10 i think this location that's zare 
Imagine is the one that we started the most with. I think A10 is the one we started with the most with. And it's not a bad idea trying to finish off, knock off the squares that have the least possibilities first, right? So this is going to be our number one. And if we're starting here, I guess we're going to try to finish off this square first. So let's try to finish off this square. Where should we go from here? Where should we go from here? Look at this deliciousness. Pineapple liqueur with soda and ice. Super good. D4. D4. Number two. And if you've got a series of movements you want to do, lay them down. So this is number two. So if we're going to stay within the grid, number three can be here. Number three can be here. Those are the only two choices if we're going to stay within the grid. And if we hit one of these, we can hit here, here, right? So we could go two, three, four, five. And then if we're going to stay within this quadrant, the only other movement we have is here, right? D1? Yeah, okay, so we're going there. So this is going to be three. Should we do four here? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Should we do four, five? Does that seem reason? Anything I lay down, uh, we're not doing no take back, so we can take back, right? If you guys want to change the location, we do. We're not going to be fascist with our movements. Is feature safe? Is feature safe in grid? C2. Okay, let's do C2. Six. So seven, we could do here or here to stay within the grid. C5, okay, we go up, seven. So we've got two possibilities, eight or eight. We could do the rounds. One, two, three. E three. Okay. Eight. Should we do the circle? Nine, ten. You just jumped ahead ten moves. <laughs> Eight. Should we do nine? Or we could do here, or 9, 10, and then the only movement we have to stay within the grid is here. C1? Yeah, so that's where we're going? Okay, done deal. 9. We could go here or here. Oh, if we go here, check this out. If we go here, we can hit here and then come back here, and then go there and then go there. And then go there. We want to nail the outsides as much as we can, right? Sorry, I'll shut up. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> so we got nine. Let's do ten. Should we do? And then eleven, twelve, possible. So ten. Let's see. They're here or here. Where should we go? Is there some general method to obtain the solution from arbitrary starting positions, i.e. selecting moves 
which maximize choices for future moves traveling along the exterior lack of caring we've tried a few different patterns right we've tried a few different patterns and uh, there's one algorithm oh actually we were gonna try the algorithm that someone uh, mentioned but I didn't look at it any further someone uh, posted an algorithm saying um, one way they were able to find a solution was basically always the next movement would always be towards the next location that had the least amount of choices in the next step right so for example if this is 10 the one that has the least amount of choices in the next step would have to be this one right because this one if you come here with 11 you would have one two choices if you went here you would have one uh two three choices if you went here with 11 you would have one two three choices if you go here with 11 you would have one two three four so you see the gist that's one method that they they said work for them well there's a couple other things in there as well Rambo, how you doing? You got timed out yesterday. <laughs> so like an A2, D2, B4, B1. Okay, let's see. A2. A2. Let's check it out. So 11. A2. D2. D2. B4. B4 and b1 and b1 done deal let's do it so 11 12 13 14 right. and in general when you get a roll like this uh, that's not a good idea so we want to eliminate a roll of just empty spots right what are you doing today this looks confusing to me rambo go to this go to this blog post boop, and it'll give you the rules of how to play and you can also do this uh 10 by 10 10 by 10 and this thing gives you the rules of the game and there is a link that that link if you click on it it should take you to a site where you can play the game online it gives you good practice okay uh, someone created that uh, that app that program for people to play the game they like the game so they created it right 14 so we should knock this up well that's no we have this choice too I would say take this out take this out and then we're stuck we'd have to go off grid or off the the what do you call it the quadrant nah rambo i don't think so never consider yourself dumb unless you try something right what's the other choice we go 15 16 17 18 19 20 that's better so check this out 14 15 16 We could go here or there. 16. Let's do this one. 17. 18. No, the other way was better. 19. So if we do here first. So 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 20 and then we have no choice but to go off grid it's like a mine sweep with no next move being in mind okay cool if we don't do d3 it seems hard to get a3 if we don't do d3 a3 yeah so we do this yeah I think I've read of this game and its mathematics around it 
in uh, some book a while ago this is very similar to a knight's uh, move in chess someone pointed this out to me where you try to get your knight to land in every square on a chessboard just using the movement of the knight right never mind you found the way that's so this is the way we're gonna go let's go this way so 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 All right and we have no choice we got to go up and we need to nail this All right so this is 21 we're off the grid or off the quadrant 21 and we want to do as few movements off the quadrants as possible right it was a yeah that was it the book of the book as well okay so that's the same book i'm not exactly certain but it was a book around all kinds of games like this yeah that was uh that was in the book as well okay it was a book around all kinds of things like that and the mathematics behind it very cool i was too young to actually understand actually i played without numbers she showed i found a pattern of victory that way really out of god but the numbers but you need to know where you're going to go next because you need to know where you came from if you need to go back right is there other versions where your moves are approximations to circles with larger links i've tried some other grids in the past i made different size grids and i've tried them but i didn't try them too much i just did them for fun jack how are you doing hey chicho i have an exam tomorrow so you have perfect timing very happy to be here awesome awesome jack <laughs> i don't think i have an exam on this but fun little break so we want to stay as close to this grid as possible but we do want to nail this guy and this guy has this and this coming out of it right so if we get to here we come to here and then we can jump out again so 21 or come here get there get there get there and then come up 21 uh, 22 24 yeah we could do this no back just forward I play blind oh you know you can't take anything back oh dangerous so we could do this 22 where did I go 22 oh yeah this 22 23 24 25 26 and then 27 again we're using up too much i'd rather come through it this way nail this so if we want to nail it that way any ideas a9 c7 might work that's right a9 c7 a9 c7 oh i gotta take this guy down c7 oh yeah right there yeah yeah perfect right on that's great learning balance that works great Liz, how are you doing hey chicho hope you and chad are good we're doing good jack no it's a health and safe uh, safety qualification so needless to say i'd much rather be doing this <laughs> nice so 21 22 23 24 25 26 and then we're out with 27 very nice that's good that's nice that's nice 22 23 24 25 26 27 and then we want to nail those two guys 27 28 
You can go 28, 29, 30. Nail it that way. So we could do that. 27, 28. We're going into all the quadrants. We're doing messy. 28, 29, 30. So we got this guy nailed as well. 28, 29, 30. Now we just got to nail this one. This one only has one out. That's gone, that's gone. It's gotta be over there. 30, 31. You got no choice on this one. So that's 31. <laughs> I'm totally here from the father. Some talk from Chicho. 31. <laughs> Son, listen to your mother. <laughs> 31 we need to get this guy 31 32 30, 30 31 32 33 31 32 yeah we could do it this way 31 32 33 oh no that's not gonna work 31 32 31 where do we go from there? I would like to know the average you get if you did random moves until you fail. You could run a, write an algorithm for that. It'd be cool to find out actually. And if you do if you do that, if a scoring system, I forgot to load up the images for the scoring system, but if you do that with the with an algorithm that runs like a million million iterations or a hundred thousand iterations ten thousand iterations get the average and then you could set the average on random moves to be zero points and then every one point above that you could have an exponential growth right maybe we should try to fill up bottom right sure we could should we play around there and then nail that on the way out yeah let's do that only a few years older than me. I need 70 plus streamers, all their God. <laughs> there must be 70 plus streamers on Twitch. We'll get there. We'll get there. Maybe we'll be one of the first 70 plus streamers on Twitch if Twitch sticks around. As long as they don't do horrendous managerial decisions like YouTube. <laughs> There's a few. There's a few. There's a few 70 plus year old. Okay, awesome on them okay let's stick in the bottom let's do this 31 let's nail the corner 32 33 right we could do 34 35 should we do those chicho is forever <laughs> jack 32, 33, oh, we lost the number, we lost number eight, where is number eight? It's gonna be that one, right? Where is nine? What's nine, here's eight, so this is eight. Eight, nine, ten, yep. 33, 34, 35 right. 35 <laughs> Rambo I'm not gonna allow that <laughs> e3 twitch is already pretty corrupt no Chicho. did we go down the wrong road Twitch are already pretty corrupt, to be honest. For instance, they protect female streamers who are practically naked. No, really? Yeah. E3. E3. Yeah. Okay, that's where it came from. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, Twitch has always been shit. 
and enforcing their rules yeah it, it it youtube is taken to another level right the ridiculousness jack i imagine the average is dependent upon the percentage of spaces which are accessible from only single spaces after n random moves jack sounds like you know what you're talking about warn me if you, if you ever look into this figure out the average let us know that'd be fantastic depends very much on which mod reviews yeah clothing is just a conspiracy by big cotton <laughs> watch out 42 <laughs> funny no shame in that very lovely defined rules make that happen this game ends when we can't make any more moves or we reach a hundred. Don't ask me how I know about set streamers by the way, list. L1, G4. L1. I1, sorry, not L1. I1, G4. G4. I1, G4 j3 h1 j3 j3 can't go j3 g4 oops i went to the wrong place g4 j3 and h1 h1 sorry sloth man slow man <laughs> learning balance posted the movements uh sooner than you so i laid them out sloth man you're true to your name you're just a little bit slower 35 where were we 36 37 38 39 right we're playing bingo mm -hmm. not bingo more intelligent than bingo uh, not a football pool no money involved sorry g3 instead of g4 yeah g3 i figured that one out that's why i went up there first i went to i4 sorry chicho i'm quite new to the mathematics side of your content did you uh, devise this game yourself? Uh, a student of mine showed it to me like 18 years ago or something. 18, 20 years ago. A Turkish student. He would, he would you know, come to my place where we're doing math and he would have this thing. I'd go, what are you doing? What game is that? He showed me the game and I was like, oh, very cool. And I started doing it and I got hooked on it for a while. And I was trying it out. Very good meditation. And he told me a lot of, a lot of people in Turkey were playing it. Uh, I haven't met anyone from Turkey uh, that has told me that they play that game, but he said there were a lot of people playing it. So I started playing it, and then I figured it was a good game to share to the community in 2015, 14. And that's when I made the video. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Slot man. H4, E4. This is bad. <laughs> it says H4, E4. Let's check it out. H4. Yeah, H4, E4. Nice. Let's take it out. Nice, nice, nice. Good, good, good slot, man. 40 and 41. We got this taken care of. So let's pop back there and try to do that. Like Sudoku. Um, no, we're not adding the numbers. It's more like knight's move in chess, right? Or knight's, uh, it's not called knight's move. It's called knight's, uh, knight's tour. The, the one in chess is called knight's tour where with the knight you move you try to land in every square All right no money next time i will pop up 100 pounds for a 98 plus bar <laughs> nice <laughs> let's do it <laughs> is that your wall or a giant whiteboard and painter's tape it's uh it's painter's tape and sticky notes i just put this together and we've done i think i created this table three times uh i would take it down every time we did the games but then i 
kept it up for the last year, I think. And the sun shines here, so when we take the painter's tape off, you might be able to see the grid with the paleness of the wall because the paint is being protected, the painter's tape is protecting the wall from the sun's rays, right? I find it most ridiculous uh, that larger news channels on YouTube suffer no consequence. Yeah, we, we, I'm not going to get into the, the YouTube. We got into it hardcore, Jack, at the beginning for like 20 minutes. <laughs> we could definitely talk about more of the U issues with YouTube uh, for covering the same. Yeah, and just so you here, we'll comment one thing. Like larger news channels on YouTube, they can monetize their content, but smaller independent journalists are not allowed to monetize certain news reports so independent news journalists investigative journalists does better reporting on a topic is not allowed to monetize a certain topic they're creating but the larger news channels are <laughs> what <laughs> crazy we have to end the game of g1 now do we uh oh no Oh, we already we already narrowed ourselves down locked ourselves in should we go back should we go back we don't want to do that should we take it back nice catch by the way learning balance learning balance if he's a sloth on the glacier can we put 100 in g1 i3 should we do that okay let's do it right off the bat then Ta -da, ta -da. let's do it we'll try it g1 so we need to get out of this quadrant we need to take care of this quadrant so we don't want to stick around we run out right so this has got to be 100 and actually let's put the pink because it's a must for them to be that right we'll use the blue sticky for things that have multiple options okay if hop 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 till you have to stop set with a pattern simplex have you ever considered doing the same related to the coal last conjecture no i don't know that uh, conjecture please keep yeah thank you elder god we'll keep it on, on. it's just youtube sent out the notifications just recently <laughs> So this is gonna be 99. Okay, we're here, 41, we're out of here. We're not gonna stick around in that quadrant. Okay, I'm gonna skip the politics talk, gang. Where are we gonna go? Let's move away from politics and continue on with number 41 let's move up we could go here 42 43 move all the way for furthest away from that as possible j2 is also closed off so the game is oh is it no it's not is it no, 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 J2 is not closed off. J2 can have, has two axes, two, two ends. G2, yeah, no, J2 is okay. Video, am I allowed to ask occasional unrelated questions? Not political, sure, Jack. As long as it's non-political, really. The politics stuff we're going to cover, we've been covering a lot. So 42, 43, but non-politics questions, sure. <laughs> I'm scared to ask. 42, what should we do? 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. Let's do it. I'm going to start laying the stuff down. Everything is politics. Everything is politics. If you guys want me to move in a certain direction, let me know. I'm going to kick it up Speedy Gonzalez style so people don't have time to talk politics. 
Sorry, Chicho. I just missed the other. No worries. No worries, Jack. You know how many times I've missed squares? That's why we're doing it together. You guys see stuff I don't see. Right? So 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. Where do we go with 50? 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. Where do we go with the rest? Super delicious. Oh yeah, let me show you my snack. Check this out. Check this out. Apple peanut butter, right? And I got some walnuts here. I've been munching on walnuts for a while now. For like a month, I've been eating a lot of walnuts. The apple and peanut butter is fantastic, by the way. We've had that snack before, but it's been a while since I had, right? Super delicious. Mm, apple and peanut butter. Very yummy. Look at that mess. Goodness. We've got movement. That's true. C9, E7, B7. C9. E7, B7, nice, let's do, 50, 51, 52, so from here we got 53, where we got 53, it looks tasty, yeah tasty, not toasty, tasty. It is very delicious, Randall. Highly recommend. Uh, you need to get peanut butter and apples, and you can have one. I'm going into my third year, but I study independently. Nice, good stuff, Jack. If you can educate yourself, you're you you rule your own world. You're a free human being. Hey, Chicho, what's up? Island King Divinity, how are you doing? Welcome to another live stream. Are you drinking another homemade liqueur, Mr. C? I am indeed. I'm drinking, this is pineapple liqueur, okay, with soda and uh, just on the rocks. It's really delicious. It's like, seriously. It's, uh, it's fantastic. <laughs> like really, <laughs> too good actually apple with apple butter would be more homogenous but you don't want it to be all together right peanut butter and apple is so good hey chicho told you i'd make it tony the tiger how are you doing how's it going everyone nice to see you nice to see you welcome back to another live stream i have to agree with jack chicho you're an agent of chaos <laughs> Did someone mention that? Possibly. I like chaos. Chicho, a 100 is possible, but I only pay for blind attempts, no feature references. <laughs> oh my god. So we got 52. Where should we go? Let's do this. 53. 53. 53. We can do 54, 55. 56, 57, 58. 59, 60, 61. We need to nail this. We come here, that's got two in and out, that's okay. Hey, I've been drinking a lot of lemon water inspired by you, Chicho. Nice, lemon water is fantastic. Brando, how are you doing? I hear that lemon water is a great alkaline. I'm thinking about making watermelon infused water. Ooh, nice. 
that'd be really good too uh and uh, cucumber is really good cucumber is really good too cucumber is also good in water <laughs> yeah <laughs> lack of caring you think alike very nice i mean regarding the apple and peanut butter combo oh regarding the apple peanut butter combo okay let's do 53 if we do this one 54 no i like the other one better 53 54 55 56 57 58 Let's see where we go from there. 53, 54, 55, 56, 57. Right. Is that agreeable? Is that what we should do? I am a cucumber guy, all the God says. I'm on critting, so I drink a lot of water. Yeah, I can cucumbers. Lots of water. Cucumber and watermelon. They contain a tremendous amount of water. Good for the good for the tummy. Keeps you regular. Fifty-seven, fifty-eight, okay, where are we gonna go from here? We could go there too. And then up there. And then up there and then down there. And then there. And there. Hmm. And where should we go from here? 57. Well, we only want to have one out on this. Oh no, we got two outs. We got this one too. 57. Here, we can do this careful chicho there's a trap ahead is there let's check this out hold on let's see 58 59 60 61 62 63 and then we'll go multiple outs should we do that but I can't help you. You can't help me all. <laughs> 58. 59. 60. 61. 62. 63. Should we stick with that? Seems good. Okay. Learning balance. Have you ever been to the Balkan, uh, Balkans? No, I've never been there. I've been to, uh, I've been to Budapest. Uh, and I've been to Czech Republic. Uh, I trekked around there, but I never made it north, east, or south from there. I'm very bad at this game. Uh, crafter, alias the crafter. I can't Im imagine images in my head. It's very annoying for chess and these types of game. Yo, man, that would be difficult. Very difficult for chess for sure. And this game, how else could you resolve it? Oh, you can't really, you need to see the pattern, right? What was this guy supposed to be? Oh man, did we forget to write down a number? It looks like it. Hey, what's this number supposed to be? Okay, what number are we missing, gang? What comes into this? 22, 21, so that's taken care of. 23 is taken care of, so it's not 23. What else comes into this? 57, where's 58? 58 went that way. Oh, I think I kicked this in because I was gonna go there, right? I was gonna go 58? No, is that it? I'm gonna leave that up there for now. Okay, gang, anyone remember if that's supposed to be legit or not? I think it is mostly practice. D9 was an alternative move. Was it? Okay, sweet. Off it goes. Thank you. We didn't play it okay awesome tony that was going to be 58 but you went a different way okay awesome you just need to see three moves in the next choice three moves in the next choice let's check this out so we're at 63 
64, 65, 66, 67, 63, 64, 65. So let's just do this for now. 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, and we're out, 70. Should we do? Then I ten. Then we keep on going that way. Sixty three. Sixty four. Sixty five. Sixty six. Sixty seven. Sixty eight. Sixty nine. Seven. Good. Never mind. Don't eat tiger. <laughs> Actually, I think you're okay, but I might be lying. Sorry, I'm playing the devil's advocate. Elder God. Are you punching this into the, the computer version of this game? So we're into 70. Now we've got to take care of this guy. 70. 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76. 77, 78. 79, 80, 81, 82. Let's do it. I think F3 has to be 99. F3 has to be 99. Sorry, 98. F3 has to be 98. Yeah, F3 has to be 98. There's only one coming into it. So that's got to be 98. Let's drop down this guy. So this has to be 98. Good catch, good catch. 98, 98. And if that's the case, then this has to be 97, right? Agree? That was after used to be a job at the vacuum. <laughs> Did it seriously? So this has to be 97, no choice. Right? I remember, I'm, I'm my head. I remember, I'm kind of smart. All the God says, "It's the ciders. It's the ciders." Every time someone would be made a saint, someone had to be devil's advocate to try and find reasons not to make the person saint. Ah, this is the same thing that I believe uh, Mossad has in Israel. If everybody agrees, there's one person that has to disagree, right? And I think that's a sort of something uh, smart thing to do, really. If everyone agrees on the same thing no one's seeing the possible things that could go wrong g5 goes to 99 g5 goes to 99 oh yeah that's right no not g5 uh oh yeah g5 goes to 99 this goes to 99 oh yeah yeah never mind these guys are right no 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 it's sure but there's only one thing that goes here so this has to be 99 and this has to be 97 because we still have to fill this thing too, right? So it's not just 99 we're con considering. Because if we go 99 there, that's the only one that goes to 100. Then if we come here, then we can never reach the 100. Ah, oh, yeah, sorry, I was late for for me. Yeah, yeah, that's the kicker, right? Devil's Aqua still is a job at the back. Okay, where are we? Oh, we lost the 10. I knew I heard something. So 70, where are we at? Should we do? Let's do. 70. 71. 72. 73. 74. 75. 76. 76. 
seven. Seven eight. Seven nine. Eighty. Eighty one. Eighty two. Eighty three. Eighty four. Yeah, we do. Fun. Now, where do we go? 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84. Nice. J7 has to be 96. Yeah. So that has to be 96. Okay. This is going to be 96. Cool. So we're at 84 right now, right? <laughs> no. From 84, we have to go there. <laughs> Do we have any other moves for 84? We don't have any other moves for 84. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I see that now on Wikipedia, but it's also less important than it used to be. Right? Uh-oh. If that's 84, can't go less 73. Unless we come at it the other way. So if we're here, let's go back. 84, 83, 82. So what if we put 82 there? 82. 83. Right? No choice. This has got to be 84. Right, and this guy's still okay because he's got two ends coming out, right? And that comes out there, and that guy. So we need to enter it from here to hit 99. Oh, I think we have problems. Thank you very much for the cheers, Jack. I appreciate it. Lots of cheers, Woo! lots of cheers. Thanks, brother. Or sister, but you're a jack, so it's a brother. 10 emotes cheered. 10 emotes cheered. Share. How does this work? Cheer, shared, reward to 10 others in chat. Cool. A was top left. Sorry. I want to get a cap. So I'm not there. Thanks for the emote. Awesome. What do we get? Pride L Pride LGBT. T like T. Haha. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. Appreciate it. What do we got? We're at 84. We got one choice. 85. 85 has got to be here. No choice there. 85. Let's see where this takes us. If this is 85, we got this for 86. 87, 88, and we're stuck. 85, 86, 87, 88. And then we're gonna hit the 99. I don't think we can get to 100, that's for sure. Game is lost since I9 is inaccessible due to I6 being broken. Yeah. Okay, let's so, we wanna do the best we can. So we know those movements. So if we land any word of these, we can do six more or th four movements, right? So where are we right now? We're at 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 
let's do this. Let's, the 100 is gone. So 84, 85, 86. Just want to say uh, thanks, Chicho. Appreciate this community massively. Awesome. Thank you very much, Jack. Appreciate uh, everything from you guys as well, right? Like huge. And the community is phenomenal. Like the, the, the group we got here is amazing, really. 99 is still okay if we can get the 99. So let's take these guys down. Oh no, let's not take them down. Let's replace them. So 86, 85. It has to go here. 86, 87, 88. Right? And then we just roll out these guys. So 88. Let's take these guys down. 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96. Oh, there was one more up there. We can get to 97, which is not bad, which is not bad at all. Spider-Man, how are you doing? How's life? Raid, raid. Let's do this, let's see. 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97. So let's take down the 100. So we're at 97. Can we do better? Can we get to 99, 98? How close are we? We're at 97. We're three away. <laughs> Spider-Man emotes all around. <laughs> Fun. Welcome, gang, by the way. Thank you for the raid. Hope you stick around and play some 10 by 10 puzzle. Hey, Chicho. Hope your stream is going to go in a while. Spider-Wife. How you doing, Spider-Wife? This is wild. Peace, Spidery. Spidery, man. Uh -huh. So cool look at all the people coming in 10 by 10 thank you spider-man doing well awesome awesome i failed math so this is just beyond me ah uh, this i don't know if this is beyond you this pattern recognition we're hardwired human beings we're, we're hardwired to be pattern recognizers right we're pattern recognition machines we're so good at it we find patterns where they don't exist right so can we do better 97 what goes into this anything goes into this 96 95 94 so if we take this back 97 96 95 94 where was 93 where was 93 94. Oh, there's 93. So 93. Can we even get into that? Oh, we can't even get into that. We can get in there from 89, but then that's lost anyway, so that doesn't work. Oh, we can get there from 93. Hold on, we can get 93. No, we could do this 94, 95. But then we're stuck. The other way is better. Already love this. <laughs> nice. Little cool jewels. How are you doing? So we can get to 95, but then this is already taken. So we're done there. It doesn't work. We've got nowhere else to go. So it's best if we go back. 94. Right? 94, 95. 
96, 97. We could, oh no, we, we could go the other way too. We could go 95, 94, 95, 96, and 97, and end it there. And in the middle. Ninety seven is not bad. Our first game. And the best we could do is do those doubles, but we couldn't get into those. Right? Good, thanks. You're doing good. Awesome. Spider Man, for those who rated with me, Chicho also does comic book streams if you guys want to stick around for a future stream. Yeah. Comic books, mathematics, economics, politics cooking stream we got cooking stream coming up and we got comic book reading coming up this weekend okay this is right up my alley awesome has anyone ever calculated how many variations successfully no we don't know the variations on this we we have solutions there's a handful of solutions that we do have but we don't know and each solution would have eight mirrors i think but uh I don't think anyone has ever done a calculation of how many possible solutions there are right oh wow we've already been streaming for one hour and 25 minutes Tenor. ah yes the mathematics of counting the mathematics of counting <laughs> ashes of ice oh shit i thought this was a recording because i was lurking hello I am still lurking because <laughs> the MD Norman Norman Grazitol. How are you doing? Hi Norman, Spider Man says. Ninety seven, not bad. Really. We've done way worse than ninety seven. And there's only three possible solutions better, and the best we've done was ninety nine. Right? So that's not bad. Counting is a headache. You don't really have to count dice power. You just have to go one more. Well, I guess that's counting, I guess, right? But you have indicators telling you where you are, right? So there must be a formula somewhere to find the total variations. We've been doing this for a couple of years now. And I the first video I loaded up was this one. Check this out. I'll provide a, here's a, by the way, here's a link to a post on my blog, which has the rules of the game laid out. And it's got a list of all the videos we've done on it. It's got some solutions on there. And there's a web page you can go to to play this game online, right? So it's got all the info compiled on one post of whatever we've done with this game. So I think the video, and this is the video I loaded up the first time ever, I think it was 2015 or 14 or something. This video here, which is ASMR math 10 by 10 puzzle pattern recognition game. You can find it on my 10 by 10 math puzzle playlist on YouTube. I still haven't loaded this on to BitChute yet, but I will be soon. Uh, so since loading this on, there's people that have come try to write programs and algorithms and stuff like this, try to deal with the fine solutions, but no one's come up yet with a algorithm that gives you all the possible solutions. People have written algorithms where they do, they run randoms, some randoms, and they go uh, give us some rules and they come up with a normal distribution and stuff like this. Um, and if you go to our Discord page on the math folder, we should have created a 10 by 10 folder too. I think that's a good idea. <laughs> Maybe we will. 10 by 10 folder there. Um, we should create and we'll just start putting everything there uh, that we have. <laughs> numbers are constant and at the best kind of puzzles do you start anywhere you can start anywhere right so there's two movement types right from any given number like we started here with number one with number one you got a blank grid right so vertical and horizontal you can go two uh, three squares away right so number one number two could have gone here it could have gone here you can't go off grid and diagonally you can be two squares away so you can't go off grid you could have gone here and that was it right so if we put number one here we have three choices for number two here here or here so we took this one and then so on and so forth 
then we went here, then we went here, then we went here, right? Okay. It's a simple as that. Really start anywhere you want see where you end up okay crazy idea would be a 12 by 12 work I someone mentioned Tony that uh, as long as the grid was even it would work I think it was odd Mick um, she hasn't been around for a while and she was she's studying mathematics or she already has her mathematics PhD. I don't know I think she's doing her PhD she mentioned that there's uh, it would work for any even grid okay I'm I'm not sure I'm going by recollection Go up to 144 instead of 100 yeah yeah weakness weakest square are the best to start at yeah and get them and there's one person that said uh, create some kind of algorithm and they said um, they found solutions by doing an algorithm where the next movement was always towards the square that had the least possible movements afterwards right so for example if you're at here number one if you go here if when here were number two you would have one two three four four possible solutions here you would have had one two three four five six seven seven solutions and over there you would have one two three four four solutions there too so you could add a choice of which one you took right that seems slightly wrong since two by two doesn't work ah true that well two by two well the, because you can't have anything less than the number of movements you could have right so if the rule is from the next square you would have to be three squares away vertically or horizontally you can't make your grid two by two it doesn't work yes chicho chicho what's going on elder god let's check this out fun should we do another one should we do another one or are we exhausted should we do one more speedy gonzalez ba, ba, ba. what would the minimum be then the minimum i think uh i have one on that post on my blog and i think it was six that i was able to get six or seven right where you lock yourself up you can't go anymore i'm going to take this down gang We gotta get at least one more game in. And we're gonna do it Speedy Gonzalez style. We'll take a pattern and I'm gonna lay the stuff down. And should we do grid or should we take the blue off and deal with the whole grid in one shot or should we stick with the quadrant method? Maybe we should do a whole grid. I'm gonna take the blue tape off, yeah? That's an option. You guys let me know what you decide. One more stack love it <laughs> oh let me take this down this thing's still up okay should we take the blue tape down random bomb hop yeah four by four doesn't work either mm, four by four it won't work you're so limited four by four so maybe the I I know there's a pattern where you could do five by five it works so it can't be even because five by five works the 25 grid uh, a few years ago I remember someone posting a solution where they just did a quadrant solo done so that worked
was DM'd. Damn you, someone just damn you to do that. <laughs> One more, let's do it, let's do it. Random bomb up. Very satisfying post-it removal technique. Yeah, it's nice. I like it as well. I'm going to go, Chicho. I'm so tired. Enjoy round two. Awesome, Tony. Thanks for popping in. I hope you enjoyed. Wh who is it that they want on banning? Elder God, I'll leave it up to you. I'm going to take the blue off. No, I got to take that one off first. Can't take the green off. Gotta love painter's tape. Gotta love painter's tape. Dice power. I want on band. Alright guys, this is good fun. Got to got to be fifty-two. On band, dice power? Should we unban? Should we try a different color? Let's try a different color. Should we try purple? Elder God, up to you. Dice Power says unban the person. Let's unban them, see what happens. If they go crazy, good color? Let's do purple. Our first purple color grid. I love cutting gross notes. <laughs> I don't know that person. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that person. Maybe not. Were they being really nasty? I'm gonna pop another apple and peanut butter, gang. Apple and peanut butter. Look at this goodness. When you have a beard, you don't want things dangling, eating them. And if you are, you're gonna eat them like this. Walnut. No, then don't unban them. So you know them, Spider Man? Yeah, I've never heard of them. Dice power, I can see your your posts. You're not banned. I was just memeing, posting in chat that I want to be unbanned from posting in chat. <laughs> oh, I get it. You're you doing a meta? Meta? Is that what it is? I don't know. I'm lost. Let's play a 10 by 10 puzzle. Where should we start? Should we start in the corner and go loop to loop? Should we do? Yeah, Elder God are gonna, Elder God and Spider Man are gonna decide. Let's do. I see him pop in another ASMR stream. I go to a lot. And he says weird shit. So I say no. Okay? No, it is. Elder God, you banned him. Spider Man says don't unban him. So banned he stays. I'm okay with that. Thinking loops would look cool. Loops? Loops we do. She constantly releases messages. I guess Chicho isn't a pretty girl. <laughs> I am pretty. Look at the goatee. 
I would not make a good female. No. <laughs> Should we do? Should we start in the corner and do loop the loops? Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have a choice now. We could go diagonal, we could go here, we could go here. Now what we could do is go diagonal and continue the loop to loop there or go here, back here and then continue the loop to loop. Chicho was handsome as hell. <laughs> Thanks Spider-Man. <laughs> Chicho. I'm dying. That's funny. Chicho, yeah. Chicho, you're very handsome. It cannot be denied. Ah, thanks, Jack. Oh, lots of love here. <laughs> I am for second chances, but just one. Okay, Alder God, up to you. I, your sword is sharp. You're the Alder. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put these in. You guys decide. So we could go like this. So whatever that number was, we could go this, and then what we could do is do this, and then hit up the bottom row here, or go up. Let's do one. Oh, one looks all wacko. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Thirteen, fourteen. The G seven, D seven, G seven, G four spiral would look cool. Okay, let's see this. D seven. Okay, let's take these back. So we want D seven. G7, G7, G4, oh, this. Yeah, so you want this. Right? Mm -hmm. 15, 16. Now we can't go diagonal or vertical anymore, right? They're out, so we got. Sorry, we can't go vertical or horizontal anymore. I'm guessing that a 144 grid would work better for this approach. Possible. Talk programmer. So what we could do? We gotta go diagonal. So we could go here, or here, or there, or there. I say we stick to the corners. Keep on going to the corners as much as we can to get rid of the corners. So 17, 18, 19, and then we could go around again. 20, 21, 21. Let's see what we can do from there. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, right? What we could do is hit the outside wall or come down. 22, 23, 24, and then we're stuck again. And then we'll go diagonal again. Should we do that? Redeem only only on Twitch for Chicho content. What do people do with with these points? 
only on Twitch for Chicho content. What do people do with these points? Yeah, I don't know. I think what it is, you redeem the points to highlight your comment if there's a lot of comments popping up. So it pops out. So the streamer could see it better, possibly. Hey, stress this message. Hey, stress this message. Yeah, talk programmer. That's basically it, I guess, right? Twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Now we can't go here, but we could go up. And then we're stuck again. We can't go vertical or diagonal. So we could do there and then go diagonal again or go diagonal right off the bat. Let's go up. So we can't go vertical or horizontal anymore. You can also unlock emotes, okay. 25. Now we have to go diagonal. We can't go vertical. We can't go diagonal. Oh, sorry, horizontal. So diagonal it is. Let's keep on going down and then up again. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, And we can't go that way. We gotta go up, and then we can't go down. We can't go vertical, horizontal again, right? So let's do this. Twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. Wow. Oh wow! Look at this. I, I didn't even see that from this angle I'm looking at it I didn't see it I had to look at the screen to see it and that looks super cool the lowest I have on that link if you go to the this website our website my website and that post I have a pattern where it's the lowest I was able to get which was like six or seven or something can someone bring me up to speed? That link that I just posted, Murdoch, is uh, the rules of the game, which is basically, you start from the, it's a 10 by 10 grid, you start with the number one, you're trying to get to 100. You got two types of movements you can do. Vertical and horizontal, you gotta be three squares away. Diagonal, you gotta be two squares away. You can't go off grid, you can't occupy a grid that's already occupied, right? Spot of D, how are you doing? I just took the blue tape down. Spot a T. I took the blue tape down. We did a grid. We did a quadrant method. Elder God, you playing with fire. Remove the van. Aesthetic, aesthetic. No, yeah. We just, we had it up for a long time. Okay, where are we at? We're at 34. So, we can't go here that's done we can't go vertical we can't go horizontal we can't go that so we got two choices that or here how about we hit this up and then we can go around again yeah let's do that yeah 35 or we come here Actually, no, we can do this. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. And then we've got choice. We can go down or come diagonal again. 35, 36, 37, 38. Hey, what's that? Did I put down the wrong place? Oops, not there. 38, so we're here, 39. Oh, I put it in the wrong place. Yep, that's a mistake. Okay, awesome. 
39. So now we go keep on going in a circle, right? 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. Right? So 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. So what do we got choices wise? We only got one choice. We can't go there. We can't go there. We can't go there. We can't go up. We can't go this way. We got that only, right? J2, not J3. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. I think going to the left gets you. Sp Spidey man. <laughs> yeah, that's a mistake. Okay. So we're here, so we gotta go there now, right? We got no choice. And we go around again, yeah? 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, and then we've got to decide where we're going to go, which is here or here. So 45, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. Yeah. I guess we're going up right diagonal from 44. Yeah. All right. Right. It will be so satisfying if this works, seriously. It will be. It fell from C3. Oh, it fell from C3. Thank you. three nice thanks I bought a whole stack of these a while ago when we we're doing these things next time I'm not gonna buy as many because these have been sitting there like seriously I bought a whole bunch of stacks <laughs> so we've played a lot this is the last bunch that we have so we have enough for one more one more stream right but right now let's do this should we keep on going Round and around and around and around. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, and then we've got two choices here and here for 69. So what do we got? 55, right? Yeah. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68. Oh, come back. I should put these on a little tighter. So we got 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76. Or we keep the same pattern going. I prefer this method. Do you, Elder God? Yeah, it's pretty sweet, actually. 
<laughs> love getting girls toys welcome to our live stream i hope you're gonna be uh good i love cutting girls toes toenails i'm assuming this is insanely satisfying nice murdoch i don't think the numbers are important just remember which is the last one which is the last one yeah and sometimes you need to take things back so you need to remember not just what what the last one was but the last few were because there's been times where we played this game where if we go back four steps five steps six steps we can go a lot further to finish right so instead of finishing at like 90 90 we ended up finishing at 97 which is a huge difference huge difference ah uh, soccer i've followed before i don't think jack I've gone to the World Cup, 94 World Cup. I spent a month. I went and saw like 11, 12 games. I went to the final of the World Cup with Brazil and Italy. And I got some World Cup souvenirs that I'll need to show you guys. Yesterday's stream, I tried to show you, but they're too big to show you. I couldn't hold it up. 8-7 feels more like what we have already done. 8-7? Okay, so we stay with the same routine, yeah? Learning balance? I think so too yes please behave learning to, uh toes okay that's true i understand that i think he is here to learn okay awesome so we stick with the same pattern let's do it 69 7 right and then we'll go here 71 72 73, 74, and we finished one more stack. Nice. 74, 75, 76, 77. Oh, look at this. We got a problem. This guy doesn't have any ins or outs. So we need to go back because if we go there we can't come out so we take it back from here we need to go the other direction agreed we have to finish an i2 where's i2 we're going to take care of i2 right now check it out so we had let's do this 69 70 71 time to change direction sometimes you're just going down the wrong path you need to turn around and go the other way <laughs> right life lesson right here one of the most important life lessons ever right Oh, we can't go that way. Let's turn around, man. 72. 73. 74. 75. 76. 77. And 78. And we have an out. Nice. 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 I'm learning about math and life. <laughs> math is life. <laughs> Sorry, I missed that too. Yeah, I didn't catch it either. I'm learning more on this stream than I did in quarantine school. <laughs> quarantine school. One of my students, her her project, math project. This is grade ten, right? This was her homework for a whole week. Look outside your window and see if you can see triangles <laughs> what? What? 72 73 74 and suffice it to say i taught her a lot more in that one week than she probably learned in two months right 75 76 77 78 and 79 nice now we gotta start being careful right 
79. Where do we go? I hope we get to 102. The video about this puzzle was one of the first videos I watched on the Chicho YouTube channel. Awesome. Knights 93. Chicho, I assume uh, you were an actual school teacher back then. Uh, I, I do private. I've been teaching mathematics for like 20 years and I do private. I wouldn't function well in the centralized education system. I would get my ass fired within a week. That's what it would work. I, I don't do bureaucracy well. <laughs> I consider bureaucracy to be fascism, really. So I don't do it well. Oh, all of you are doing well, indeed. You too, you too, night 93. Spidey man. I just graduated high school and I had my calc class during the pandemic. My teacher kind of gave, gave up. <laughs> our homework was to redo our functions class. Damn, that's funny. E7, E7, G5, E3. E3, is that where we are? Where are we at? 79. Did we do already G E seven E seven E seven E seven G five G five and then E three Okay, let's do So we're totally changing our pattern now to a certain degree. Well I guess we're still going this way. So eighty eighty one 82 oh this is nice actually 83 84 85 80 oh yeah let's do let's do 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 91 92 and we have one out let's fill them in let's see where we get to after three you can you can go around yeah notice that awesome get my friend's older brother who got a hundred in calculus to give me the rundown nice calculus rundown find the derivative okay where are we 79 80 81 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. So we only have one choice here, 91. If we go here, 92, 93, 94, we're stuck, right? So we gotta go that way. 91, 92, 93, 94. Oh, wow. 91, 92, 93, 94. This method worked phenomenal. Oh, wow. Four moves. You should still go through the proofs. Blah, blah, blah. Do we get 99 in this? I don't know. We're going to try it. Oh, yeah, for sure. I went over. That was up. Oh, wow. So 94, 95, 96, 97, 98. Look at this. 99. <laughs> awesome. 94, where are we at? 95, 96, 97, 97, 98, 99. Oh, snap. Look at the one. <laughs> That's pretty good. Good job, everyone. Yo, fantastic job. That was phenomenal. It's, it's the color pen. It's the purple pen. From now on, we're doing purple. 
Look at this. That was so relaxing. That was so smooth. Just go around and around, and one time we change directions going the other way, right? Good job, everyone, indeed. Spot of tea. Very nice. Red balloons. <laughs> oh, God. I'm cringing so, so hard seeing that empty square. I know. What do we do? Well, we got to keep it empty. We can't fill it up. It would have been awesome if it was somewhere else, right? But it's right beside a 99. It all has to do with color. It all has to do with color. My OCD. Were we supposed to get to 99? We're supposed to get to 100, right? We're trying to get to 100. We start off with number one, right? And we do the movements, the two movements, vertical and horizontal, three squares away and diagonal two squares away. We're trying to get to 100, but we got to 99. I mean, that's pretty sweet. It, I think this is only the third time that we've gotten to 99 playing this game. That's pretty good. So any idea what to change to get to the... Oof, what goes into this? Let's check it out. This is one thing I do. I look at it to see what goes into that. So 43, no way we're going back to 43. 81 is not bad to go back and check it out. 35, no. 41, no. 83, even better. Right? Nope. 65. 96 96 but it's gonna get stuck right so if we take these down we could have gone 97 and then we're stuck right so that's not an option so the only other the next closest number we would have to go to would be 83 and man going back to 83 you would have to take everything down to 83 and then from here go to here and from here you would have to go to 96 because that's the next highest number from 83 right because 81 would have been already filled so this one it's out would have been there so 83 would be 84 85 86 87 and then it doesn't work out you need to actually remove there's too many iterations from there right but that's what I do if I ever want to go back. I look at the closest, the next highest number that is reasonable for me to go. We tried 96. 96 doesn't work. Then you go to 83. If 83 doesn't work, you go to 81. Right? But we ain't going to touch this. I'm happy with 99. <laughs> it's like how in the Hikuru no go, when he plays, his move, his go moves based on aesthetics really yeah it's like one of the things the what's that saying usually the simplest the most obvious answer is the correct answer or something like this or go with your first instinct or something i bet you can go back and get 100 if you go go back once <laughs> you want to create chaos i'm happy with 99 i'm not a greedy i'm not greedy You have to follow a set of move movement rules so you can dead end uh, dead end at any time tough i can't decide whether to be excited or disappointed yeah it's i'm excited seriously because also you have to consider we did this one speedy gonzalez style right how long did this one take us we had like 30 minutes left of the stream so we took over an hour to do the other one the grid format the quadrant format and this one we did in 30 minutes we got to 99 the other one we got to 97 took twice as long right so it's pretty sweet dying at 60 is possible yeah and this game and in life <laughs> easy peasy fun gang we leave it there i'm gonna keep this up until we do again right and slowly what happens is they fall down and i collect and i collect them and i put them on the side and then before we start the next stream i grab them put them all together hopefully we don't lose any and i stack them and i've been keeping these by the way i've been keeping these by the way to generate money maybe i'll auction them off or something 
<laughs> once once we something happens to YouTube, right? Who knows, right? Oh, we're back to politics. No, back to politics. So so good. Dying in sixty is possible. Hundred pound would have been paid for that. Oh yeah, if you said we got to a hundred, you would have done a hundred pounds. Oh, we lost at a hundred pounds. <laughs> so so good spider-man you brought us good luck with your raid very nice thank you to your uh, to your people coming they brought us some good vibes we ended up at 99 what was the number on the first game you played uh 97 we got 97 on the first one and we tried hard on the first one with 97 like it took it took some doing to get 97 I gotta learn to put these on harder so they don't fall down as much. The wonderful Chicho and chat have a great time, guys. YouTube vides. I'm glad you enjoyed. I've been here the whole time. I'm eating a mango, a nice bite, man. Gang, that was fantastic. Should we call the stream? Should we call the stream? Let's call the stream, yeah? We're going to be streaming, I believe Saturday, we're doing a cookout. I'm going to show you guys how to, how to make dolma, Armenian Persian style dolma, more Armenian style dolma. Okay. And odds are we're going to make it with meat as well as veggie. Right. Uh, and then we're going to do a comic book reading, I believe on Sunday or Monday. Our schedule, what's our schedule? We got to find our schedule. Yay, I'm glad. Thanks for uh, uh, everyone who rated it and stuck around in the chicho is awesome thank you very much spider-man murdoch too i was literally just about to ask when the next cooking stream is shortest game i found was eight was the shortest game eight cool it, it, would, could there be shorter i don't know i don't know how you could make it shorter if you did I don't know. Comic book reading night before. 26. Our numbers are falling down. I gotta go through and push all these in. Okay, gang. Uh, our schedule, should I show you guys our schedule? What's our schedule? Uh, here, let me post our schedule for you guys, gang. Uh, that way, I know what it is too. Uh, if you go to our Discord uh, page, you'll see our schedule uh, on the schedule folder. But I'm going to post you the uh, our next schedule on Patreon because I have a list up there and I can usually find it easy. Uh, yeah, cooking stream on Saturday. We're starting at 12 p.m. Uh, Pacific time, my time. And then we're doing a comic book reading on Sunday starting at 11 a.m. And then we're doing uh, investing in personal finance on Monday at 9 a.m. So let me give you guys our, here's the post for our schedule. And that'll take you to the Patreon page. We lost two numbers already. 26, 62, where was 62? 26, 26 is here. Oops, 26 is here. Oh no, that's 92. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Check this out. What? Right? 92, 62, or is it. Does that work? 29 or 56 or 26? I don't know what this is. 26 or 29? crazy i'll put these back okay gang i hope you guys have a fantastic fantastic evening okay mods elder god spider-man spot of tea thank you very much for taking care of business thank you for being here uh everybody thank you for the conversations and thank you for the directions and giving us letting us where to go letting us know where to go and helping out huh? right 99 happy with that happy with that bye everyone <laughs>